were you surprised by the success of the first film and the fact that to talk of a sequel came up because normally sequels are, you know, superhero <laughs> movies sure, and for sure. you know, sci-fi things and yeah. not necessarily stripper films. I think in terms of <laughs> subject matter that people would have expected a sequel for, male strippers probably not high on the list. Uh, I do think that when we were doing the movie, we all knew something special was happening. So we really felt great about the first movie, just in terms of the experience we had and, and, and feeling or believing that that would translate, you know. Um, we ended up being right, and here we are doing a second one and actually getting to take that great time and impart it once again to audiences on an, on an XXL scale. I mean, bigger and better. There's more comedy, more fun, more levity, more dancing, more sexiness. I mean, you know, this movie really kind of took all of the things that you got a glimpse of in the first one and just really just exploded them on screen. What is it that you think the audiences really related to and really you know, connected with from the first one. Was it just the chemistry between you and the other guys that that was so amazing, or was it also like that and a little bit of the physical too for the ladies? Or well, it, you know, I think for both movies, it's the skin that gets you in. Sure, you know, I <laughs> the mean, skin that gets you in. That's exactly really what it is. It's the skin <laughs> that gets you in, and and really what ends up making them successful, and 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 I think really making audiences respond to them is the humanity in them. You know, and in the first movie, we in terms of you know the human experience we examined what the dark side of this life is about and, and how it can be something you get caught up in and it's not something where if you're not fighting to grow where you can pretty much just stay in limbo for you know 20 years and you know Tarzan's character represents that somebody that's been in this life forever and is you know just caught up in this vicious circle of doing this same thing and you know doing drugs and blacking out and dancing and you know and never really getting to the next place in life and this second movie was about, okay, all of these guys have grown up a little bit and, and, and we got a glimpse of them in the first movie and we enough to be curious about them, enough to like them, enough to want to see more about them and this second movie was like, okay, let's explore the light, let's celebrate the lives of these guys, let's see why they're friends, let's see you know, what the, what the great side of this experience as being male strippers has been for them and, and why it's hard to give up this life and, uh, and then let's watch them give it up, you yeah. know. Uh, going out on a high note, of course. Well, let me ask you, the first time you read the script for the sequel, Channing's script, mm -hmm. and the idea, and obviously he has this background, he, he knows these guys sure. who created these characters, but the fact that these guys are gonna take a road trip, yeah. and they're gonna, you know, kind of see some things even in their <laughs> world they've never seen before. I mean, what was your reaction? I mean, my reaction to the idea of a road trip was like, yes, that sounds like a party on wheels, of course, and, um, you know, Reed, uh, Channing, Reed, all of us really from the first movie have remained really close friends and so we talked regularly and when I first got wind that this, it was long before I ever read the script, but I knew that there was a road trip coming and the idea of putting these guys in a space where we were on a road trip, <laughs> I just, I was like, come on, hurry up with the script because I want to see what this is going to look like. Um, and once again, the script came. The story idea is great. Uh, the, you know, everything that was in that script was like stuff that was going to be fun to explore, and we all showed up so excited to do it that that we just can't help but elevate what's on the page, and and, and when we bring it to life, bring it to life in a bigger, better way.